morning everybody to see a girl Bella J it is Sunday morning chit chat and I come to you with some creepy old blouse that I made some time ago very big it's very wide so if I had extreme love handles it would be perfect so today as you saw the opening I was in the laundromat very early and I usually go anywhere from every three every three weeks to a month later I usually when I have no more clean socks is when I go in because I don't like wearing dirty socks I mean I have enough clean socks and I still got to get more but it doesn't matter I wash out my undies by hands you know the deal I want to show you all right now what I did yesterday take a look Yes, that's what I did. I was cleaning my, actually I switched my room around, cleaning it, and and let me explain something. I need not buy any more lashes, tweezers, material, any article of clothing from the thrift store, nothing. I need not buy nothing. I have way too much stuff here. Foundation, everything. There is nothing that I am in need of that's how serious it is you know it's i gave tweety the illuminizer that i have from nyx cosmetics i mean when you really think about it i don't want to have excessive stuff not at all i had to take off these glasses i gotta trim my eyebrows because they're long and some hairs are growing back in so i gotta take that out but yes <laughs> cleaning 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 how was your thanksgiving my thanksgiving was great i am tweety cooked everything the only thing i made was macaroni salad and trust and believe i only gave some to somebody else there is no more there is plenty and it's about to go to the garbage there's no need to have it because nobody eats that we just happened to have made it and it was a waste had somebody had a potluck out or somebody needed some salad i would have definitely donated it but the oxtails are gone. The coconut rice is almost done. The greens are going to go because that's canned greens. And it just tastes very metallic. So that's going in the garbage. The ham and the chicken, I'm about to pluck it apart and make a Spanish version of Sancocho with the leftover meats that we have there, which is basically chicken, the ham, and my neighbor gave me a piece of turkey. So we're going to put that in the pot and I'm going to make a nice little sopa, Spanish style soup. And that's what you do. I learned that from on roof when I was always spending Thanksgiving in Long Island. That Sunday after Thanksgiving, she would pluck the turkey till the turkey could not be plucked anymore and made a nice soup, soupy style stew so that it'll ease your tummy. And that is perfect for anybody. And I can go for that right about now. I just have so much. Like I could not believe how much makeup I have how much stuff I have in here and I tell you I want to throw everything away I just want to toss it away I just want to throw it all out and not have to bother with it it is disgusting it is horrible and then I had to clear out my closet Juji's back in the hallway as far as her litter her food and everything bring some stuff and put it back in my closet and I just feel like I have way too much stuff and I don't need this so I am I gotta work this out help me I wish I could just give somebody my old makeup give someone I have a laundry basket full of clothing that I don't use I need to repurpose the shirts if not give them away with that being said, let me know what's good for you. I will be cooking for Thanksgiving, I mean for Christmas. And if you would like to see me cook Christmas dinner or prepare for it, let me know. Maybe I'll do a vlog preparing how I do my meat. Because Tweety wants beignet, which is roast pork. And I know to make the rice and peas, but we're going to do everything. The meat has to be marinated a day 
or two before and everything else can be cooked the morning of um, and she's also we're we're considering doing a breakfast so we want to do like mango which is mashed plantains in the morning and have some you know fried um, Dominican cheese eggs salchichon well a turkey version of the um, salami is a turkey version pavolina so that's a turkey type salami and um and just do that for breakfast so we're still trying to come up with a consensus as to what to make but also we're also trying to plan out new year's oh yes it doesn't end there so let me know what's good with you let me know what's going on with you and right now i have to go back to cleaning i can't even show you what's on my table let's just understand that i need to be able to have a table to work on that's the only reason why i moved everything all right with that being said i send you all a lot of love and happy holidays later